Sam, send Callow the nav point provided by our Krogan contact. Drac, we're landing on Elodin to rendezvous with Jorgal Strux. On my way. meeting place exactly called the paradise middle of nowhere as far as I can tell paradise is different for a Krogan I will gather what information I can, Pathfinder. here besides the Krogan? Scavengers with nothing to lose. Criminals chucked out of Kadara. Gonna be interesting. I'm gonna head to the colony, smooth the waters.
heat levels increasing. in everything. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Heat levels increasing. We want to be careful. From what I hear, it's swarming with scum. Just make sure you know where your guns are. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Yeah, pull the whole thing apart. Just go away. I got in on that deal. I didn't do it. Didn't do nothing. Okay, you didn't do anything. Good. Tell them that when they come. Well, that was interesting. levels are climbing, Pathfinder. Automated protocols activated. Deploying forward. Ryder, head towards the colony when you're ready to get our transport back. Park's waiting at Ford's greenhouse. Got it. Mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. temperatures are within acceptable limits. Life support restored. So, Elodin. Charming so far. What do we got? Besides the sand. The Revenant monolith suggests this was indeed supposed to be a golden world. It also suggests the presence of a vault. Additionally, here is the large derelict remnant ship that we saw as we landed. Hopefully abandoned. Scans indicate it is not. The site is active with scavengers and remnant bots. Here, scavengers have taken over an abandoned camp between the two. In this direction, located in one of the planet's sinkholes, is New Tachanka, the Krogan colony. Sinkholes. Sounds fun. Not really. Elodin is tidily locked to its sister moon and that gas giant above. This side of the moon never cools. Getting trapped in a sinkhole without shelter would mean certain death as one's blood would boil in 75 seconds. And on that cheery note, let's head for the climate-controlled paradise of the Nomad. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. Hey, hey! Lucky the paradise has. Heard you killed Klex. Did I hear you talking about the Remnant? Dunno. You an eavesdropping snake? Been breaking it down to sell. Could make a killing from the pieces. Uh, Ryder? You should check that out. Push off. Push off. Get out of my face. Nothing at all. Get out of my 
I detect above normal temperatures. See if I won't. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Life support is back online. Ania is traded for water with Kandara, but not this much. Tried the flop house. They shot at me. You'll need to speak with Ania first. You cut the deal with her, she gives you a chit, and I dispense the water. You can take your entire allotment at once or in portions. Up to you. Seems odd to place the water tank so close to that gaping chasm. Someone once told me Ania does it as a security measure. She empties the tanks into the gorge if anyone tries to steal the water. I've never seen it happen myself, but others have. Can you imagine? What a waste. Is all this water for sale? Some of the supply goes to the trading post, of course. But yes, most of it's for sale. Anyone who wants water on Elodon has to come here. There is very little elsewhere on the planet. Where does this water come from? <laughs> I believe that's a trade secret. I don't even know where she gets it. At first I thought she traded with Kadara, but that can't be it. It's impossible for all this volume to be from Kadara. I'll let you get on with your work. Have a lovely day. Hey, I recognize your insignia. Your Nexus, right? A Pathfinder. Kent Halsey, Nexus Security. Didn't know your duties reached all the way to Elodin. It doesn't. I'm here for... personal reasons. My sister Isabel fell in with the wrong people. She joined the Rebellion and was exiled to Kadara. Somehow, she pissed off enough people to end up in this hellhole. Your security and your sister's a troublemaker. Puts you in an awkward situation. I don't care about that. I'm here to find her. I know she can't come back to the Nexus, but we can start over on Kadara. Together. You're a good brother, Kent. Don't congratulate me yet. The problem is, I underestimated this planet. I don't have a vehicle or a way to survive the heat. I'm stuck before I've even started. Don't worry. I can track Isabel down for you. I hoped you'd say that. I think the Salvager from Kadara has info on her. She wouldn't give me anything, but maybe you can get her talking. Fancy ship you got there. Need someone to punch it? Almost croaked out there. That's a water storage set up over there. What are you 
you looking at? Um, what? Nothing. Really? Because it looks like you're looking at me. I don't like it. I'll look where I want. Yeah, maybe I'll shoot whoever I want. I thought the rule was no guns. That won't protect you outside the gates. If you see me there, you better run. Pathfinder, is it necessary to engage with this individual? I don't see how it helps our cause. Right. Let's just back away slowly, guys. What are you Rider, looking at? I heard that little exchange. I don't understand it. They screened every initiative applicant. How did so many of them end up violent and unstable? You think something's up? That's what I want to find out. Can you scan the scavengers here in the Paradise and transmit the data to me? And, you know... Wow. Be careful around that one, Ryder. Got it. What are you looking at? Well, well, look at you. I'm good at reading people. Want me to guess who you are? Shoot. A Pathfinder. How do you know? I cheated. I run salvage to Kadara. Word travels fast there. Should hear what the Collective is saying about you. Well, now I'm curious. I won't repeat it, for your sake. What's your take on Elodin? If the Worm or the gang leaders don't kill you, the Heat and Ataraxia will. I don't know how anyone can live here. Somehow, they make it work. Barely. At least once a trip, an escaped slave or ex-cultist tries to bribe me for a ride out of here. Except the Krogan. I've seen new Tachanka. We'd all be lucky to have a setup like theirs. You said you run salvage to Kadara? How does that work? The scavengers come from Hell's Promise to sell me their scraps. I pay them next to nothing. Charming. Then what? I haul my loot to Kadara and sell to the merchants. Sloane takes her cut, naturally, but mostly I make a killing. Sometimes I even buy water from Aenea and sell it at a premium in the flop house. It's a solid life. If you say so. You must deal with the scavengers a lot. No more than I have to. Slavery, cannibalism, gang leader worship, it's enough to make my skin crawl. I plan to keep my distance. Smart, but it's not just the gang leaders. The ones in the Paradise are dangerous too. This is supposed to be a neutral zone, but I don't trust the scavengers to follow the rules. Got info on someone named Isabel Halsey? What am I, your personal database? Come on, you're the only one here who doesn't want to kill me. Just help me out. Fine, fine. I I've never met her, but I heard a few scavengers talking. Mention a cave out in the dunes. Something about Isabel's time being limited. This is the nav point. Just watch out. That's a bad area. All of Elodin is a bad area. Good point. Take it easy. Always do. You've survived the gang leaders and the worms so far. I'm impressed. Ever work with a guy named Reyes? Reyes? He's one of my buyers, actually. You know him? He used to. Know where he is? Haven't heard from him in a while, actually. No one has. For all I know, he's living it up on the Nexus. Take it easy. Always do. Think I'll stick out? Like water in the desert. My boss.
Bossonier picked up on you from the second you landed. What's your boss like? She gave me a job and a place to live. I'm grateful to her for that. But? She's not easy on your kind. I've seen her deny them water based on nothing but her mood. She didn't live on Kadara like I did. All she's seen is the exiles on Elodin. It's enough to turn anyone against outsiders. But I don't like seeing people suffer. Even exiles. So you work for the water merchant? I design the filtration systems. Now I keep them from breaking down in the heat. You're an engineer. Of sorts. On Kadara, I designed defense systems for the settlements. Specialized in hidden traps to use in the dark. <laughs> I can't continue that work here. Why? The sun never goes down on Elodin. No nighttime. Just constant blazing daylight. It's why the Paradise does so well. Water isn't the only commodity. We have shade. How do you end up here? Same as anyone. I was desperate. Ran up a debt on Kadara and needed to escape. I have to say life isn't bad here. I move between the Paradise and New Tachanka, keeping the water tanks running. Sometimes I even go to the flop house to buy extra parts from the scavengers. They respect me there. Still, I miss the exciting stuff. Felt like I was making a difference when I built defense systems. If you want to make a difference again, the Resistance needs recruits on Vold. The Resistance? It's a nice thought, but I doubt they'd take a low life like me. With your skills, Ephra will welcome you. We don't turn away those who want to fight. You're a member. You're looking at one of the best fighters in the Resistance. Is that so? Fold, huh? I guess it'd be a change from all this sand. All right, fine. I'll check out the camp, see what I can do. It's a fair exchange. Why? Because you... You're a near. That's right. You've heard of me. Word gets round. You thrive on Eladin, which is supposed to be uninhabitable. True. I have made something of a paradise here. No fighting, no violence. Outside the gates, you're on your own. But in here, you're safe. Anyone violates the peace, they have to answer to me. Yeah, everyone's on their best behavior. Is it natural, or are they on something? Huh, <laughs> nothing so complicated. These people need me. They need what I sell, so they behave, or they're out. Now what can I get you? How can I help? Just let me know. I'm supposed to meet a Krogan here named Strux. Look around. If my customers have names, I don't know them. It's better that way. You have a pretty good attitude for a place like this. I've got nothing to complain about. I'm rich, and no one messes with me. Most powerful woman on Elodin. Yeah? I don't mean to brag, but absolutely. What else is here? I'm a businesswoman, not a tour guide, but I'll tell you what I know if it suits me. You get along with the Krogan? Everyone comes to Elodin with the dream of leaving, except me and the Krogan. They built their colony into a sinkhole. Smart. Keeps it cool enough for them, I guess. They have their own water? Unfortunately for them, no. But Mordor and I get along well, so far. Who lives on this planet? Desperate folks, mostly. Misfits, some. Those that can't get along in the regular world. Or people willing to make a profit off that desperation. Like you? Careful, sweetheart. You want to keep me on your good side. There's a place they call the Flop House, east-ish of here. Den of murder and misery. You should pay it a call. What can you tell me about that derelict ship? Ah, oh, you came here to get killed, did you? Scavengers are trying to pull it apart, is all I know. I don't go near their claims. They shoot on sight. What can I buy? I don't know. What do you have to trade? Mostly I sell water, but you should go out to the tanks if you want that. Is there anywhere else on the planet to, I don't know, find water? Not really. And if I don't like the look of you or you get on my bad side, then no water for you.
Nice duds. Better watch your back. There's probably already a dozen people planning to kill you for them. Are you threatening me? Sounded like it. Me? No, just trying to be helpful. I know a hard target when I see one. And I stay on your good side. Maybe you won't mind me picking up the scraps you'll leave behind. So, what else can I do for you? What do you do on this planet? Why are you here? Why? Trying to find out where my claim is? No, relax. I do the same as anyone else here. Try not to get killed. You know a Krogan named Strux? Nope. But Krogan are hard to miss. Look around. Where do you live? Where do you sleep? There's a flop house not far from here. There's always shelter. Maybe even a bed, if someone died that day. We're done. Suit yourself. Strange. Data's not coming through. Try another one. Not a scavenger rider. There a reason you're pointing that thing at me? I, uh, sorry. Subtle. Also not a scavenger. Not a scavenger rider. Are you Jorgal Strux? Maybe. You who I think you are. I'm the Pathfinder from the Nexus. You asked me to meet you here. Yeah, I did. Thanks for coming. Everyone's best chance for survival is to cooperate. That includes the Krogan. Good. Nice to know some people are on our side. So, there's problems at the colony. It's heading to a bad place. We can't be there anymore. Morda's become a tyrant. Did she kick you out? Hasn't come to that yet, so we're laying low. I want to keep my eye on her. She's planning a strike against the Nexus. That much we know. Drak trusts Morda, and I trust Drak. I'm there. Drak isn't. Morda is going to rip this colony apart. 
and then we're all going to die. Krogan dying? Your homeworld's worse than this place. Everyone needs food and water, even Krogan. Morda's rationing. My group thinks the Krogan should make peace with the Nexus. We need the Krogan, and the Krogan need us. We all came to Andromeda as one. We should at least try to fix this. Well, there won't be a colony to make peace with if Morda ruins it. You don't believe me? Go to the Krogan colony yourself and see what she's planning. Talk to Ravenar Brink. He's one of us, on the inside. If the safety of the Nexus is really on the line, I'll go. Better hope she doesn't shoot me on sight. Yeah, that'd be a bad omen. on the next boat to Gadara. I detect above normal temperatures. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Levels increasing. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Ryder, 
I've analyzed the scans you sent me. I found something odd. Each scavenger's neurons were firing at an abnormal rhythm. What does that mean? It's only a theory, but I think some people are more susceptible to complications that can happen during the cryo process. Their neural paths were... Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. Watch your step. This area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Avoid the sinkholes!
You're approaching the refuge of Dirk Barrett. We are not hostile. Repeat, not hostile. Please do not shoot. Don't trust everything you hear out here, kid. Life support at 100%. Temperature levels are well, climbing, Pathfinder. It's better. I advise against prolonged sun exposure, Pathfinder. Gonna be hard to avoid out here. Pathfinder, I'm Dirk Barrett. I speak for everyone you see here. Glad you're hearing me out instead of shooting me in the face. It never really hurts to listen. I agree. Most of the people who live here don't, as I'm sure you've noticed. They kill anything that moves, including each other. Long-term prospects for survival? Zero. <laughs> Me? I haven't lost my mind. I don't want to die. Neither do these people. That's why I need your help. Well, I am the Pathfinder, and I'm pretty sure my job description includes help people survive in Helios. So, shoot. What do you need? First, we need to move. This shelter is small and can't be fortified. Another gang has taken over a base about 20 clicks from here. Beautiful setup they don't know how to use. Idiots taking apart the walls for scrap. If you can help us clear them out, I think we'll be good. I'll see what I can do. Thanks, Pathfinder. Anything else you need to know, just ask. You and your crew aren't as violent as the other scavengers here. From the start, Eladin was about how much firepower you had. Got firepower, you can take what you want. Resulted in lots of people using their guns to get bigger guns. Eventually, I had to step back and think about what I really wanted out here, and how to get there. Turns out I wasn't the only one. Why did you come to Eladin? Seemed like a good idea at the time. <laughs> yeah, I know. Not the smartest move. Kadara bothered some people, Sloan muscling her way into Angara territory. I guess some of us wanted to start with a clean slate. Too bad I got shit on so fast. If you manage to get a fortified base, what then? Trade, hopefully. We know the Krogan are out here. Once we're set up, we'll try to make contact. Maybe if we're really successful, the other exiles will come around and join us. I just know that anarchy is unlikely to get us very far. We need people working towards the same goal. I like your optimism. That's the stuff we need to really make it work out here. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm a romantic at heart. What can I say? I'm not stupid. I know it's not gonna be painless. But, as they say, if you're gonna die, better die trying. Nothing else right now. I'll head out. All right. Won't keep you. We need to get out of this heat zone.
I'd like to test the serum on a live subject, but we need a good candidate. Scan the scavengers at the Paradise again. I'll tell you when I see a potential. I don't have nothing. I just want to give you this medicine. It might make you feel better. Feel better? Haven't felt this good in years. I don't want your blasted medicine. If you take this, you can feel normal again. Start your life. <laughs> a life of serving the Nexus? Of being bored out of my mind? No thanks. I'm free as a bird now, and damn, it feels great. Just leave me alone. Leave all of us alone. We're happy just how we are. What if your brain decays more? You can't live like this. Just take the serum. And if I say no? I won't make you, but you'd be making a big mistake. You're a pain in my ass. Fine, give me the stupid thing. Finally. I take it, you leave me alone. Now shove off. Not the first patient I've had who resisted treatment. Are they really happy this way? It's their sickness talking. Is it? I wonder. I'll monitor his progress and send you my findings. Thanks, Ryder. We're gonna end here. Heat levels increasing.
that a problem? It is if they get their hands on a remnant core. It could become unstable and attract the Scourge. How do we stop it? Beats me. Pathfinder, I could modify your Omni tool to disable the cores and prevent them from reacting. Do it. Let's go fix this. increasing. Life support at 100%. increasing. Pathfinder, I detect scavenger interference at additional remnant sites. Never make it easy for me. Let's go to those other sites.
activating automated forward station deployment. You know the drill. Go find those cores. Mining zones in this region are available, Pathfinder. I've added them to your nav system. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Pathfinder, there is still a risk of the scavengers damaging remnant cores. I suggest using your Omni tool to disable the cores. Looks like the Scourge got to this remnant. Pathfinder, I've extracted data fragments from this cache. They may be valuable later. Pathfinder, there is still a risk of the scavengers damaging remnant cores. I suggest using your Omni tool to disable the cores. Life support at 100%. Life support levels are critically low. This area can be mined for resources. 
you can extract minerals via your mining interface. Pathfinder, someone is attempting to access your comm unit. Should I patch it through? Go ahead. Hello, you're a Pathfinder, right? I recognize you. There'll be scavengers ahead. The sun didn't get them first. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface.
I detect above normal temperatures. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Pathfinder, I detect broken scavenger machinery ahead. Think that's it. Good work. Another memory trigger? Yes, though my memory array remains locked. Additional triggers are required. Thank <laughs> you. 
I detect above normal temperatures. I detect a dip in temperature ahead. The scavengers have set a dune camp. Hey, I... Oh good, you heard me. I was starting to think I'd have to walk back to that rundown shack they call a landing zone. What are you doing out here? I'm a scientist from the Nexus. I've been surveying Elodin's geography for several weeks now. And now I'm stranded on this hellhole. Tell me what I can do to help you. Glad you asked. A few days ago, my shuttle overheated and died. Then I ran out of water. After two days without a drop, I got desperate. Ended up trading a part from my ship to some scavengers. Once the delirium subsided, I realized my mistake. Turns out I sold them my thruster, which you need to fly. The Tempest can get you back to the Nexus in no time. And leave my ship here to be picked apart. If I leave, that shuttle needs to come with me. I figure since you're a Pathfinder, maybe you can talk to the scavengers. Get that part back. I'll have that thruster for you in no time. Helpful and efficient. I like that. I'll give you the nav point for the camp. Be ready. They're a prickly bunch. Are you studying the sinkholes here? I'm trying to figure out what causes them. Any luck? My scans show a high concentration of calcium carbonate deep below us, high enough to create pockets of brittle rock. These pockets break down and collapse, and it causes a chain reaction all the way to the surface. Incidentally, that would also account for all this sand. Have you learned anything useful about Elodin? That depends on what you consider useful. Try me. Well, I assume you know Elodin receives constant sunlight. There is no nighttime. But I've found evidence of a rare temperature dip, which means the planet experiences an occasional eclipse. Can you imagine? Constant blazing sun for years, then a week of night. It must be jarring. Good luck out there. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining into...
High temperature alert. Do not proceed. Reading a normal. It appears he's been dead for several hours, Pathfinder. But who killed him? Pathfinder, I detect movement. Someone is behind that door. Residue indicates this crate once held weapons, but it's now empty. No weapons on the dead scavengers either. Analysis of alcohol content reveals it was brewed here on Elodin. Made here? Out of what? It's probably safer if you don't know, Pathfinder. I... I can be friendly. Let's talk this out. You want to tell me why you were sneaking around in there? You saw the camp. When Axius comes, the only thing to do is hide. Who? You haven't heard of him? Axius leads the meanest gang on Elodin. They run raids on other scavenger camps, never leave anyone alive. Last night, they picked our camp. I was lucky enough to find a hiding place. Been in there ever since. Your gang bought a thruster from a scientist recently. I want it back. That piece of junk? Didn't even fit our ship. Axius must have taken it. He took everything. You can try getting it back from him if you have a death wish. I'll even give you the nav point. You going to be okay by yourself? This happens all the time. I'll find a new gang. Oh, one more thing. If you see Axius, shoot first. He's not a talker. Likely Axius and his scavengers. Records indicate Axius has multiple bounties on his head. Be careful, Pathfinder.
This appears to be the thrust catalyzer from Nora's ship. Finally. Let's get it back to her. I detect above normal temperatures. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Pathfinder, we're approaching a scavenger site. I advise caution. Yes? 
I got your ship's thruster back. Well, catalyzer, same thing. Seriously? I wasn't sure you'd pull it off. I went to a lot of trouble for that. Took down some nasty scavengers. I'm not surprised. They're an unpleasant bunch, aren't they? Well, I'll install this and be on my way. I've got a lot of planet to cover. Be careful out there. Right. I hadn't thought of that. Thanks for the rescue, Pathfinder. I detect above normal temperatures. Ambient temperature is normal. The remnant site could have a few lurkers. Automated protocols activated. Deploying forward station. Mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder.
Another memory trigger? Yes, though my memory array remains locked. Additional triggers are required. zone. I detect above normal temperatures. Ambient temperature is normal. Life support is back online. That was another memory gate, Sam. And the last. However, a deeper level of encryption is in place. Unfortunately, the conditions to unlock it haven't yet been satisfied. Life support is back online. Thank <laughs> you. 
Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Heat levels increasing. Reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. start of theirs join up with strangers like us besides who says i'm old who says i'm dying i don't think i said that you did i'm certain i didn't now you're saying i'm deaf right now nope not getting involved hey you're not wrong Chow. i am old but i got a lot of living left Volatile canister nearby, Pathfinder. Another tracking signal on this canister, Pathfinder. These scavengers are up to something. Let's keep an eye out for more.
Life support is stable. Levels are climbing, Pathfinder. about this place better keep our heads down you ever hear the saying honor among thieves yeah an honorable knife in the back is still a knife i'm reading a normal temperature range pathfinder Life support yeah, is back online. Still hot. Yeah, still hot. Activating automated forward station deployment. Pathfinder, I detect scavenger constructs ahead. My systems in this region are available, Pathfinder. I nice added them to your nav system. Sounds like trouble already.
Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. Life support at 100%. above normal temperatures. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Heat levels increasing. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. levels are climbing, Pathfinder. security terminal, I may be able to attempt to bypass the locks remotely.
wonder what was here before. The scavengers must have taken it over. Mining outpost failed, abandoned. Bypass the command center's doors from here, Pathfinder. Please try to remain within range of the console until the process is complete. We know we're here.
there. Let's hope that stops them. Levels increasing. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Nice work. Gotta do something, kid. Can't let these scavengers murder those people. We should get to that site as soon as we can. I detect above normal temperatures. to find an alternative to combing the wastes. Hey, did you make sure comms aren't set to wide broadcast? Uh, what? Ah, oh, shit. Ah, uh, comms just went dead. All of the colony's water comes from Aenea too. The deal works right now, but it may not last. This impacts the long-term survival of everyone here. Krogan, Exiles, it doesn't matter. We need to improve the situation if we can. That's what I like to hear. Where do we start? Those scavengers talked about security around Ania's office. I bet there's something there.
I detect above normal temperatures. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Life support is back online. I don't think we'll last much longer in- Heat levels increasing. Stay alert. This junk is prime for scavengers. Sam, this little mouse, can you get a location on him? I do not have enough information, Pathfinder. But I may be able to track down the scavenger writing these logs.
base Barrett wanted us to clear out. Well located, good view of surrounding area. I understand the appeal. Way too easy. Shuttle spotted incoming. The ambient temperature is normal. Life support is stable. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Life support is back online. Security is pretty sophisticated. I wonder what they're trying to protect back here. Yeah. I detect above normal temperatures. Ambient temperature is normal. We need to get out of this heat zone. Heat levels increasing. 
The ambient temperature is normal. Hey, Pathfinder, you still alive? The base is clear, like you wanted. Excellent. We'll start preparations for the move immediately. Come by when you can. We might have some stuff hoarded around here that you could use. Bear it out. I detect above normal temperatures. I'm reading a normal t Lots of guns, equipment. Heavy munitions stockpile. This could take down something big. Outpost or a colony. Think Barrett knew this was here. I don't think he had an ulterior motive. I mean, of course these scavengers are gonna stockpile gear. I don't like it. He might have plans to attack the colony. Barrett's not getting this. We'll take it for the colonization effort. It's safer in our hands. Sam, get word to the Tempest. Move this gear before Barrett finds out. Understood, Pathfinder. are climbing, Pathfinder. I've been reading Krogan history. I have a few questions. Careful, Krogan have a saying. History is written by the victors. Krogan do? You're from Clan Nakmore, but you weren't born into it. You chose it. Yeah, the shaman of the clan was strong, and the Craddock wastes were beautiful. And you had a rite of passage. It wasn't so much a rite of passage as a death trip. I survived. Now, I'm Neckmore Drek. Rig ahead. We should shake the outlaws loose. Here they come! That canister looks like it'll cause some damage. Tracking source yet? No, Pathfinder, but I'm getting closer. One more should do it. Watch the grenade! Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. Best. Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. set up a dune camp. Stay on guard. Got them all.
I detect above normal temperatures. Sam, you get any data fragments from that? I did. They appear to be related to the first cache, but scavengers have damaged the memory. Life support is back online. I detect above normal temperatures. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Life support is back online. levels increasing. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder.
life support at 100%. Isabel's mentioned in this. Updating your interface with the nav point. I almost have her. Automated protocols activated.
mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. Heads up. Looks like a scavenger dump site. They left a data pad. Who would steal from a kid? Pathfinder. I need more data to locate this scavenger. Pathfinder, there was a nav point fragment attached to this one. Was that if you find more, I Isabel? may be able to piece them together. Sounds like she's in charge. Oh boy.
You're from the Nexus. Should have known. I don't sell to your kind. Matter of principle. If you're Isabel, your brother sent me. Kent? For what? He wants you to go back with him, to Gadara. Well, you can tell him I'm not going anywhere. On the Nexus, I was a merchant's assistant. On Kadara, I ran errands. Now, I make weapons for the most powerful gang leaders on Elodin. I get perks, protection, and no one would dare touch me. Finally get the respect I deserve. And the best part is, I don't have to talk to ass kissing Nexus dogs. Except now, I guess. I'll just tell Kent he's wasting his time. Glad we reached an accord. Now get out of my camp. Didn't I tell you to leave? increasing. The ambient temperature is normal. Galaxy calls the Milky Way. It's not, but Liam said it. <laughs> Milky Way is what the humans call it. We have our own word, Salarians of theirs. So, what do you call it? It's 600 years away. I call it gone.
Doesn't Sam just freak you out, Jal? A bot whispering in Ryder's brain, hearing her think. Not at all. I'd love to take Sam apart. See how it all works. Though I'd need more information. Schematics. I wouldn't want to kill him. Goes without saying. Yeah, conversation over. Remnant derelict. Not the only one in Helios. Activated. Deploying forward station. Mining zones in this region are available, Pathfinder. I've added them to your nav system. Ambient temperature. Detecting deep seismic activity in this area. That thing is massive. I wonder what brought it down. Wanna bet we're gonna run into a bunch of angry remnant? Yep. And they're probably cranky. Environment check. Temperatures are within, except... Watch out! That's a field of death! support restored.
more around every corner. One your six at my back. I detect no additional glyphs in the area.
We need to find a way around this! Pathfinder, your shields will not withstand this for long. Out of reach of those surges down here. I see a turret ahead.
all your things! Stop shooting! They've probably been burned by that one before. casually talk about one of the most painful things about being Krogan. Yes. My clan's stronger than most, and this trip... Time. Let's just say we're working on it. Ambient temperature is normal. I detect above normal temperatures. Undocumented mineral nearby, Pathfinder. Ryder, there's a remnant data cache here. Pathfinder, I recommend scanning. Life support levels are critically low. Get an update from that, Sam? Yes, Pathfinder. I've narrowed the data to Elodin, but can't get a clear read. Reading.
you learn to fight, Jal? What's your training? From my father. And older brothers. And sisters. And cousins. My mothers. The Resistance isn't an army. It's more than that. What was your rite of passage? <laughs> I, I fell in love when I was a young man. Very young. We met on a farm on Aya. She was brilliant. And her eyes were electric. For years, I suffered with a broken heart. Not what I was expecting. I understand completely. Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. I detect above normal temperatures. I detect above normal temperatures. Track. When I mentioned the woman who broke my heart, you said you understood. Yeah, I did. Can you tell me why? Did someone break your heart? Hearts. Krogan have four. And I'm not saying shit. <laughs> I understand completely. Life support systems offline. Automated protocols activated. Deploying forward station.
mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. The ambient temperature is normal. Life support is stable.
good to be on solid ground again. You don't feel exposed? The cat are everywhere. I'd rather face them down here than stuck in a can up there. Undocumented mineral near by Pathfinder. <laughs> that scan completes my mineral database. The Geophysics VI is functioning at peak performance. Chief Lucan will be happy to see his baby running smoothly. The VI isn't his child, Pathfinder. It's just a saying. Never mind. What about recycling? Can't rely on that. In this weather, we lose too much to evaporation. Just look. Hey, it's the Pathfinder. Ryder. What are you guys doing? It's a whole bunch of nothing out here. Have you heard about the merchant in paradise with an unlimited supply of water? We thought we'd try to see where she got it from. No luck, though. A lack of reliable water might be a problem later. Yeah, and we don't have any choice but to trade with India. I'm asking. Anyway, we should head back. Be well, Roger. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Life support restored. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder.
Still looking for big game out here. We had Thrasher Maws. Gotta kill one to prove you're of age. And if you didn't get it? Then you didn't live longer. Seems like you could skip the battle and... Oh, damn. Stasis pods from Ark Natanis. Are any of them alive? It's difficult to obtain a clear reading on all pods at once. We should investigate. <laughs> Sam, we should have Mason's genetic. Too many variations in the genome. Not Mason Barrow. Reading negative. This one's got power. Subject is a child. Turian, but not their pathfinder. Perhaps a distant cousin. No match. None of them. Help me get it open. Pathfinder. The body has no vitals. Damn it. The stasis pod still functions. I can access its data history. According to the final log, this stasis pod was jettisoned from Ark Natanus. Because of the scourge? The timeline doesn't match. This pod was ejected long after Natanus was reported missing. We assume the Ark was destroyed, but maybe it's intact. The crew could still be alive. And dropping dead weight. We should update Avatus. He'll want to know what we found. Your timing is impeccable, Pathfinder. Another minute and those scavengers might have been wearing our skins. 
You're not serious, right? Who knows? We've heard stories. The desolation makes people a little... unbalanced. I don't suppose you could call for help? Of course. Sam, relay this location to the Tempest and get them to send a shuttle. Done, Pathfinder. Help is on the way. We'll just wait here till our ride comes. I don't expect we'll run into any more trouble. Thank you again. I thought we were it's dead. Damn scourge. It would have been terrible to we survive that crash only to be killed clipped. by scavengers. I hate Thank you again. sometimes. Jow, you're tougher than you look. And you're smarter than you look, Drak. Stubborn, though. You talk like stubborn and smart aren't the same thing. Hey, kid, don't forget we need to find information on it. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. Almost croaked out there. Everyone's treating you good, I hope. What can I buy?
think this is Ania's office. Check the security on that door. I'll keep a lookout for guards. As expected. It's locked. A scan should tell you how best to proceed, Pathfinder. the code for the office door. For him, let's be quick in case Ania comes by. Underground lake. That's where she's getting her water. Got the nav point. Let's get out of here. going. Need something. What can I buy? I detect above normal temperatures. off at the Nexus. You'll want to be careful around her, kid. It's amazing they managed to set up any kind of working colony on this hellscape. Amazing? Or oh, crazy? And the Krogan seem to be a bit of both. Hostiles ahead! I've added it to the first. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. Nice 
Nice work. Activating automated forward station deployment. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. You're older than some civilizations. Personally made sure of it a couple of times. Let's introduce ourselves. Life support is stable.
That should complete the glimpse, Pathfinder. Life support restored. I am dying, though. <coughs> Sorry. While back, you asked why anyone nearing the end of their life would come all the way out here. I've lived a long time, seen a lot of things. I know I won't see much more. Guess I just want to go out seeing what no Krogan ever has. I respect that. It's an honor to fight by your side, Drac. <sighs> Feelings mutual. Okay, let's solve this thing. Interface successful, Pathfinder. levels are climbing, Pathfinder.
Spider, worm. You're much larger than the rest of the initiative species. You'd think that'd help. Don't trust small people do anything to get their shots in. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. I think that's enough. That did it.
Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals by your mining interface. You wear a lot of dead things. Is it for respect? A celebration of life through reverence of death? It scares people. Piss me off. I'll wear your spine for a hat. How did Ania keep this hidden? I wonder what the Remnant Builder's plans were. I'm disappointed, Pathfinder. I thought you were someone I could trust. I welcomed you into my home, and you repay my kindness by robbing me. Hey, I didn't take anything. Left every single drop of water where I found it. Count them if you like. Very glib. Do you know why I do this? My brother tried to help your people when they first came here. He showed them where to find shelter, allowed them to take freely from our water tanks. He was killed for his trouble. I won't be as foolish as Asgar. That's awful. You have my sympathy. I've no use for sympathy. You can keep it. These scavengers respect no one, not me, not you, but they do respect the planet. As long as they need me to survive, they live by my rules. You want me to forget everything I've seen? Exactly. You say nothing. You allow me to protect myself and my home how I want. You expect me to do this just because you asked nicely? Your Nexus needs resources to survive. Elodin is rich in those. What I gather, I will share, just so long as Elodin remains mine. How long have you known about this water? Asgar and I found it years ago, on a mining expedition. The Remnant nearly killed us. I knew, even then, that I wanted to keep it a secret. It gave us an advantage. It took time to convince Asgar, but he came around eventually. I made him promise. By keeping this secret, you're preventing anyone from establishing a real home here. I've allowed your Krogans to stay. It shouldn't be about what you allow. It's not up to you. 
So now I have to sit by and watch you destroy everything I've built. I will hound you every step of the way. This isn't over. Get them! Kill them if you can! Done. Great. And he got away. What now? Get word to Cash. She'll put someone trustworthy in charge of the trading post. Sam? As you wish, Pathfinder. I have relayed the information to the Nexus. Let's hope this works out for the best. are climbing, Pathfinder. Are within acceptable limits. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. Good to see you, Pathfinder. Director Addison and Supervisor Kesh gave me the task of overseeing operations here. With luck, we'll soon see some changes on this trading post. Now that Aeneas gone, what are you trying to do here? I'm sorting through Aeneas' books and forwarding what I find to the Nexus. The plan is to maintain this trading post and offer support to the Krogan colony. Later on, we may use it as a base to expand Nexus mining operations on Elodin. What are you going to do about the water situation on Elodin? The water you found is being distributed fairly. People can expect to receive as much water as they need when they come here. Regardless of who they are. Even the scavengers? Even them. They've been advised that any abuse of the privilege may result in it being taken away. They seem to understand. For now. Have you encountered any resistance? Any violence? Is everything okay? We have enough guards and soldiers to put down any violent opposition. For now, it seems to be working. Perhaps we can rehabilitate the population of the planet, but that's a long ways off. Well, I'll leave you to it.
Okay, Remnant Vault. Let's get this place up and running. field pathfinder. Looks like there's a trick to this interface. Let's figure it out. the reactor and initiate the purification field. isn't it? The unknown. There'll be more.
Remtech? Bet we can grab it on the way back. I will add this map to your interface, Pathfinder. Several interface connections converge here. I will highlight the ones you need. Sir. Remnant, you can lay low or take them on.
able to get to the purification console. Enemies! Life support is failing. 